Okay, so. Hello, Capricorn. Now, keep in mind that this will not resonate for all of you. If it does not resonate, please just leave it. It, you, I don't, I don't want to hear about it. Now, if you like a personal reading, I'll leave that description down below. Another thing you do is we have memberships on the channel, so you go ahead and join, become a member, get access to all those perks, okay? So, let's see what the rest of 2021 will be like for you, Capricorn. What you doing? You're starting something here. You got love. My hair is that it's whatever. We have the devil. So this is Capricorn energy, so that is you. We have the two of wands. The four of wands. We have the two of cups. Six of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, Three of Wands, the Five of Wands, uh, Capricorn. <laughs> I do see love coming into your life, like a relationship, could be with another Capricorn. Um, what I, I also see you kind of being in this boss energy. Like you're starting things, you're not taking crap from anyone, you're doing what you want here, and I actually see you accomplishing a lot by doing that. So, let's see what else. We have the Star Brothers. You're not alone. You have the Blue Flame. Deep healing. Okay. Capricorn. A lot of you are going to be um, awakened suddenly in 2021. You, you step through this awakening moment. And it's a feeling of you're not alone. And a lot of healing going on for you as well. Now, the Star Brothers card, that can talk about like an actual brother that you have that you feel a very strong soul connection to, that you've lived many lifetimes with. It can also be like some, let's say if you don't have a brother, some other family member. So let's see what else. Going on a journey here, Capricorn. Ooh, 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 ooh. Capricorn. <laughs> you have number 20 with envy. Number 34, door to personal healing and happiness. 27, walking away. And number two with journey. Capricorn, I see you working towards your own happiness here. You moving towards your own happiness. Like, I don't see you putting up with anything that makes you unhappy. Like, I see you walking away from that, and that's gonna cause people to be jealous of you while you're doing this. So... They're gonna be like, wow, Capricorn's so happy. And then they're gonna be jealous of what you're doing. Goodness. Goodness. We have Spring. We have the White Witch. Capricorn, I feel like this is you. <laughs> uh, we have Druid. The High Priestess, yes. So, so as I am saying, you're going to be spontaneously awakened, suddenly awakened. And you're gonna be like this high priest, you're gonna be this person that is, you're gonna be more spiritual, more spiritually awakened throughout 2021. Some of you might even be a witch. So that's interesting.
Yeah, number 25 with high honor. Yes, you're going to be achieving a lot here. 2021 Capricorn. I'm losing my voice. We have number 17 with gift. Number 18 with child. Number 7 with message. Another thing here, Capricorn, is you might be receiving a gift from a child, or maybe you're gifting something to a child this year. I'd... Okay. Something about a child. Ooh. Ooh. Capricorn. We have the underworld in the box. You here are going to be, like I said, you are going to have the spiritual awakening, but I, I see you like communicating with spirits. You're going to be more in that spiritual realm, communicating with the dead spirits. You're going to be stepping out of normal everyday things, you know, because that's not a normal thing. <laughs> but it's unique. It's special. We have number 18, the shining star. Glow, I no longer dim my light. I shine bright for all to see. Stepping into your power here, Capricorn, we have number 40, the mirror. Reflect, I hold the mirror up to see and accept and love all of me. That's a lot of healing, stepping into your power. Achieving a lot, too. Capricorn, there's something magical going to be going on within you throughout the rest of the 2021. So we have number 18 with Magic Stream, number 52 with Magical Map Shifter, and then we have the White Witch. It's going to be a magical year for you. <laughs> Goodness. See you unlocking a lot of like abilities, gifts, and you stepping into the power. Are you being confident about that? What else is coming into your life? We have travel. So this can be actual travel or this can represent the journey that you're on. We have new beginnings, willpower, transformation. There's there's a big change going on within you. Okay, you're st I see you changing, Capricorn, like you yourself changing. And you being more confident, you being more strong about that, you being more empowered and you You got something magical coming to you this year, and I feel like that's you yourself, you unlocking those abilities about you. You being this high priestess or high priest or witch. And I actually see you achieving a lot. Like, I see you being in this energy of you awakening. You know what you are, and you not putting up with anything from anyone anymore. Also see like a love or relationship coming into your life, possibly later this year. Okay. So, Capricorn, that is all I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. Um, if you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye, guys.